here, hello. So as titled, this is a collective summer haul. I've been sporadically buying many things that I've been wanting for this spring and summer. So I have accumulated a bunch of things. So I wanted to sit down and share with you guys some of the things. Some of them didn't come yet, so I'll probably try to do another video on it. But I know I haven't posted like a fashion type video in a while, so I wanted to get this up for you guys. And yeah, I just wanted to say that this video is in partnership with Boohoo. So thank you to Boohoo for working with me on this video. All opinions are my own and everything else that is not from Boohoo, I did purchase myself. I will be linking everything down below with the size and color and yeah i'll try to include some additional info if it's relevant and yeah i think that's everything so let's just jump into it yeah so i i guess i'll start with accessories because that's what i've been really into recently so if we see here I have my own collection of bucket hats that I've just accumulated over time. So actually, I think this yellow one or the green one was linked by my friend Yuyan here on YouTube and Instagram. <laughs> She's my girl. She always has like the cutest things. I've been looking for a bucket hat everywhere, but I haven't found any. So I'm really glad that Yuyan recommended one. And this one actually fits on my big ol' head like perfectly and I'm so happy to have come across these because um, a few of them that I did get um, they didn't really like look right but these look super right so I actually got them in a few different colors they are on sale right now so that's why I got I picked up a few and I really like them they're really stylish but also um, you can wear them you know when you're at the beach fishing to cover your face it's kind of a different alternative to like a um, like a dad hat, like a baseball cap. Um, those kind of crinkle your hair too, and they look like a bit too athletic. So these are like just super chill, beachy vibes. So I'm really into this. I do think that this is a trend that will last, and they're really cute. And hopefully Cody will wear them too because I got them with him in mind. So yes, I got it in this really cute pale yellow color all of them are from urban outfitters and i chose to get some colorful colors because i feel like they're like a pop of color on your head and it just makes your outfit so bright and happy so i really like that also that if you get like a more plain color it kind of neutralizes your outfit if that's what you're going for but i wanted something more of a pop of color so i got this yellow one and then i got this green one i think this green color is my favorite next to the yellow i like i really like greens i've been really into greens you can see here this um really mellow green has been my favorite color recently um i think because i've gotten comfortable with green like with all of the olive greens and stuff like that so moving into a lighter green and then of course i had to get like a baby blue blue is like a pretty standard color for hats i feel like so i got it in a baby blue color and then this guy is a little different if you guys can see because i have a ring light on it's actually like a reflective material so um uh, if i didn't have the ring light on um it would just look like a regular satin gray but it's like a reflective color i thought this was like super cool it also pops like if you ever like do a story with like flash or anything and also if you're like walking at night the cars can see you i mean not that that's a problem but i just thought it was like super cool and i think this one was on sale too so i'll link it down below if it's still available but it's like super cool what's it called not a hype beast but like hype beast yeah okay <laughs> ah, i'm like the last person to talk about those things Okay, next, I wanted to talk about more fun stuff. So I did pick up some bikinis out from Boohoo. I think this is actually the first time I've picked up bikinis um, in all the times that I've worked with Boohoo. So I'm really excited and I'm happy to say that they are awesome and they fit really true to size. So I'm really, really happy about that. 
look green what is happening but this is more of like a minty green i think they actually call it mint yeah so this is mint i got it in my standard size four and it fits me to the t so i would say get it true to size so this is just a regular bandeau top it's super, it's actually so flattering on like i know when i'm holding it up it looks really blah but when you try it on it's just so flattering i think it's cut like the right size like it's not too long and it's not too small so i really appreciate that because there's no padding i do put a little pad inside for myself um just because that's how i like to wear things but yeah just keep that in mind it is not padded when it comes um and yeah i don't really do like crazy water sports in bikinis anyway and i wouldn't wear this one if i were gonna do that so yeah just keep that in mind and i got the high-waisted type of shorts because i like that so you can see they're super high-waisted you can hike them up really high they're super flattering but they're also kind of cheeky so you can tan your cheeks so that's super good um i love this color on me like i got a little bit of a tan over the weekend because i went out on a picnic with my friends which was really nice um so your girl has a little bit of color so this looks really nice against my skin tone so i'm really happy about that and then the next bikini i got is a white one i feel like i always have to get a white one white just works on all skin tones i feel like so this one has like a really cute acetate ring in the middle so it's kind of a detail so i feel like i get detailed plain colored bikinis or i get plain bright colored bikinis but you know that's what works for me so yeah i have this white one it's super cute it fits me to the T, it's a size 4, and then I also got bottoms in a size 4. It's the same kind of bottom, so it's high waisted, so you can just hike them up to wherever you want, and they're also cheeky, so you can tan all the parts. And with the bikinis, I got my first sarong. Of course, I've seen people wearing it like at resorts and at hotels and stuff, but I never. I've never owned a sarong before. I feel like I'm growing up and I want a sarong. So we have one, I have this one. I still have to figure out like all the different ways you can wear it. I saw it on the model and it looks super duper cute. It's like this warm neutral color. So I think it matches with a lot of the bikinis I have. And I also tried it on with the bikinis that I got in this haul. So you guys can see what it looks like on. I'm still trying to figure it out, but yeah, I feel like a grown up with this wrong. Let me know what you guys think, but this is my first one. So yeah. So next, I want to go into like athleisure. I've been super duper into athleisure, especially with what's going on. We don't really get to go outside much, but sometimes I'll just like run out and get like food or groceries and I don't really want to change. So that's the reason why I picked out so much athleisure. And also I feel like athleisure has been really in recently and I hope it never goes out because I'm just so happy about it. I've been really getting into it. So yeah, I picked up two pairs of sweatpants. I really like it in this beautiful baby blue color. It's kind of like bright so you don't look so blah in like sweat. Sometimes I feel blah, but if I want like a brighter color, I'm really happy that I have these. I really like these. Yeah, a lot of Boohoo's sweats go out of stock really fast. So I would say if you like any of the ones that you see, definitely pick them up before we go out of stock so I got this in a size small and I really like these because they kind of are slouchy at the ankle and I realized that that's what I like to look for in sweatpants they have to be slouchy at the ankle and they have to have the elastic band at the waist and at the ankle I feel like when it has that it just looks super cool and you can pull it off but it still like fits your body because of like the elastics so I have it in this really cute baby blue color, and I also got it in a charcoal color. I don't have so that's in a charcoal color, so that's why I have these. They also have pockets in them, which are really awesome. Pockets come super in handy, especially when you go out and you don't want to touch anything, keep stuff in your pockets. It's definitely really useful there. It also has the tie at the waist if you want to like hike it up super high and tie it there. That's also an option, but for me, the elastic is enough for me and it also kind of like holds you in you know with all of that stuff so i'm really happy that i have these in my life and following the point of sweats because it's getting warmer and i don't want to give up sweats we have sweat shorts 
So that's what I'm wearing right now. It's in this lovely light green color. I also got it in baby blue and black. I think those were all of the colors that were available in my size. So I got them all in a US 4. They, they fit me perfectly. They're just a little bit loose in the right parts and they're super flattering. So I really like them. They also go super high-waisted. And of course, since they're shorts, I'm definitely not going to like overheat when I wear them on a warmer day. So I'm really happy about that. I have a bunch of colors to mix and match. I would say probably if you want it to fit a little bit looser because I do see that that is a trend, definitely try sizing up. But if you more so want it to just fit you, definitely it is true to size. And most of the time when I'm home, I'm wearing like really drab stuff and I don't look so cute. So I kind of wanted to pick out a set for me to wear at home, but I can also wear out. So it's like this ribbed black t-shirt. You can also mix and match them, but this comes at a set. So it comes with the ribbed biker shorts and then the ribbed loose t-shirt. So when you wear them together, you look really put together, but also super casual. So I really like how it looks like on me. And it's also like complete black. So I feel like it's super cool. And definitely if you accessorize it with the right things, like a chain necklace and some hoops, you definitely look super put together. And I really like that. And I also feel like I can definitely wear them separately. Like I've been really into biker shorts. So I can wear this with all of the other stuff that I have in my closet. And then this, I can also probably tie a front knot on this and then it will look like a loose cropped front tie t-shirt. So that's super cute as well. So I'm really happy with this set. And following the athleisure trend, I've been seeing a lot of tops that are buttoned down. So both of these tops are buttoned downs. So they're like this polo knit style where it's buttoned down all across the bottom and then you wear it like a little bit open this looks super cute with like denim shorts but also with like athleisure shorts i feel like you could definitely wear it when you're doing like really preppy sports i don't know if that's like super specific but me and my friends been talking about trying to go play tennis and i thought that this would be like a really cute tennis shirt or you know even golf you know yeah but i've never actually played golf but i just feel like <laughs> this would look really cute you know like a, a preppy athleisure outfit it would look really cute you could also dress it down super casual i've kind of stayed away from college shirts from the longest time because in junior high it was our uniform but i think enough years have passed where i don't hold a grudge against a polo so here i am many 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 years later with a polo so yeah, it's super cute. I got it in this white color. It is this ribbed sweater material, so it's really appropriate now where it's not too, too hot and it's a little bit windy, so you could definitely wear this. And then I also got it in a black color. So here it is. I really like the buttons that are on this shirt. They have um, a little bit of an iridescence to them, so it makes the shirt look a little bit more expensive and detailed. So I really like this detail on this shirt as well. I also have to say that I really like that the collar is like flexible and floppy. Like it's not too rigid because I do not do well with rigid collars. So I like that it's floppy, so it's very it's a very casual polo, and yeah. Okay, so lastly, I have my dressy tops that I got. Of course, I had to pick out some dressy, cute tops. I think first I want to talk about this one. So here she is. Let me know if this looks familiar to you because this is the white version of the black top that I got last year that I wore so, so, so much. I got so many comments on it, so many compliments on it in real life. So I guess if there's anything um, for you guys to get from this haul, if it is your style, definitely pick this one up. This one in white or black. I think last year this wasn't available in white or it was sold out. So I'm really happy to have got my hands on the white one. It's just so like angelic and beautiful. You can wear it on your shoulders as well as when you pull it down, you can wear it as an off the shoulder top. It's just a ribbed crop top here but it's also pretty long so it's super appropriate with all of my bottoms and it has this beautiful see-through polka dot sleeve they make it a little bit longer than your arm i feel like so it's like super cute <laughs> but yeah i'm really happy that i have this one 
And then next, I got a block. A block. <laughs> I got a black crop top. It's kind of like eyelet lace. You guys can see that there's holes through it. It's super cute. It's more crop than what I'm used to, so I think I'll definitely have to wear it with like my super high-waisted stuff and then show a little skin. So same thing with the white top that I just showed you. You can wear it over your shoulder as well as when you pull it down, you get it as an off-the-shoulder top. So it's really awesome to have two options in one top. Um, this one is a little bit more cropped, so I think on days that I want to show a little bit of midriff, I will wear this. Definitely will pair it with like my highest waisted stuff highest stuff but yeah it's super cute i don't have a lot of black crop tops so yeah and then last but not least i got this really detailed ruched top it has a lot of detail to it and i was really drawn to the style of it it kind of cinches in your um rib cage in a sense and it's super flattering on so i really like it because it has so much detail i feel like it puts together your outfit for you you can literally just throw this on with a pair of like denim shorts denim skirt and you're done basically it's like a super dressy top so i'm really glad to add this to my wardrobe because i do have a lot of plain crop tops but this one has a ton of detail in it so it's super cute super girly i really like it so yeah, that was everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Hopefully I showed you guys some things that you guys like or at least enjoyed spending some time with me. Yeah, I have a lot of things that I do want to post. It's kind of been hard to sit down and edit because of everything going on, but I'm definitely trying to balance everything. I would say definitely stay educated, be diligent, be the change. Also give yourself time to Take everything in, um, definitely keep up your mental health and everything like that. If you need some time, take some time. And I know that I want my channel to be a place for you guys to just chill out, relax, positive vibes, do a little bit of shopping, do a little bit of laughing. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new here and you liked my video, please subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Make me wanna fly Cross my heart